Sana Van Dijk, congratulations, you are a world bronze medalist, you have the world bronze. So how are you feeling right now? Uh, happy, of course, with my first world medal, but uh, for me it was nice if it was gold, but uh, it is what it is. You, you had an awesome day, uh, and then of course when you, you lost, how did you manage to, uh, what did you say to yourself to get in the right mindset to be able to go and fight for a bronze medal? Uh, yeah, I, I had really no doubt in my mind about the bronze medal fight. Uh, going into the semi-finals, for me it was clear it's either go gold or bronze today. Uh, I want to go for gold, but then when I lost that one, it was clear that uh, it was going to be bronze and not a fifth place. So when you won the medal, tell, talk us through your feelings in, in that moment. Uh, of course, I'm happy I delivered uh, in the last fight. Um, yeah, it's been an emotional ride and uh, it's a nice step forward uh, towards the Olympics but uh, two steps higher in the Olympics, please. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so what are you going to do differently at the Olympics? What are you going to work on between now and then so that you go away with the gold? I'm not going to fight Ono in the Olympics, that's, that's for sure. Uh, I don't think we need to change an awful lot. I think training's been going well and uh, just uh, some fine tuning. And I think then I'll be ready for the Olympics. Uh, as part of your prize, you received a smartwatch from Huawei. Tell us what you think about uh, this smartwatch and how you're going to use it. Uh, I'm really happy with it. And uh, I think uh, it will be good to uh, use the statistics uh, for training. Thank you so much, Sandra. Congratulations.